The WHO estimates that neurological disorders will represent 15% of the global disease burden by 2020. Hence, there is a growing need for new pharmaceuticals that target the brain. However, the chance of getting a neurological drug to the market is three times lower than for other drugs. This is because of the blood-brain barrier. This natural protective system for the brain prevents harmful substances from accessing the brain. But it may also prevent potential neuroactive drugs from reaching the brain. Therefore, drug developers need to know if and to what extent a pharmaceutical agent crosses the blood-brain barrier. Scientists from Yoenium Research have developed a minimally invasive catheter based in vivo technique for preclinical substance monitoring in the brain tissue. Cerebral Open Flow Microperfusion, or COFM. It allows us to see beyond the blood-brain barrier and to monitor drug concentrations and drug action at the target site in brain tissue. The COFM probe is implanted into the brain. The resulting temporary rupture of the blood-brain barrier quickly heals. It is re-established and fully functioning within 14 days. Perfusion fluid is pushed through the COFM probe into the brain tissue, where it comes into direct contact with the interstitial brain fluid. The fluid can then be continuously sampled and rapidly analyzed to provide a dynamic in vivo metabolic profile of the brain. Multiple substances can be monitored in this way, including drugs and biomarkers, regardless of size and lipophilicity. COFM allows you to monitor the transport of substances across the blood-brain barrier and to understand their action behind the BBB. Our technology can also be used for early dose response tests without transport over the blood-brain barrier. By adding the substance of interest into the perfusate, pharmacodynamic testing is feasible without any formulation challenges to overcome the blood-brain barrier. We look forward to helping you understand what's going on with your drug, beyond the blood-brain barrier.